And with the Emancipation Day celebration gone and on the eve of independence celebration, the professor of history is once again making an argument for reparation. Professor Vereen Shepherd pointed out that it is estimated that in 1776, British parliamentarians and clergymen were major shareholders of the slave trade in the Caribbean. But the Western European powers have refused to apologize, they have refused to take responsibility, and they have refused to engage in any discussion over what Robert Beckford says is a debt amounting to $7.5 trillion. British pounds owed to the CARICOM region. She said against this background, CARICOM has taken steps to establish certain initiatives. All CARICOM countries must establish within a month a National Reparation Commission. Four Car CARICOM states already have such commissions. Jamaica, Suriname, Barbados, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Antigua and Barbuda. That's why she's urging all historians to join hands in presenting a case for reparation. The cause for reparation for genocide against the indigenous peoples of the Caribbean, the kidnapping, forced migration and enslavement of Africans in the Americas, the MAFA or African Holocaust, the establishment of chattel slavery as a unique form of bondage and as a global regime of racial terror. The exploitation of Indian people through the 19th century indentureship system and the murder of hundreds of people in various post-slavery protests across the region. Simone Absalom, TVJ News.